Hello, everyone. In Canada, Indigenous people and communities face serious inequities in health and well-being that require immediate attention. This includes a higher rate of many illnesses compared with other Canadians and generally poorer access to healthcare services. Today, I want to update you on some of the work we are doing to improve access to care and help family physicians feel better equipped to treat Indigenous patients in their practices. Here are some of the highlights. The College and the Society of Rural Physicians of Canada recently co-hosted a rural healthcare summit that included a focus on Indigenous health. This event drew leaders from across the country, including the Federal Health Minister, to discuss and commit to steps that will help enhance access to care in Indigenous and rural communities. The roadmap that guided the summit and the meeting's outcomes will inform our work on an ongoing basis. In terms of education, the college is surveying all postgraduate family medicine training programs in Canada to better understand how postgraduate education in Indigenous health is being addressed. Early responses indicate that there are strong efforts underway to include Indigenous health in curricula, to offer more opportunities to learn about Indigenous culture, and to increase the number of Indigenous students in medical programs. This information is helpful as we work on new accreditation standards and examine CanMed's FM roles in training. We will likely incorporate competency elements around cultural safety in the CanMed's FM expert role. As for practical tips, the College has produced a guidance document with information on how to address the healthcare implications of systemic racism affecting Indigenous people in Canada. It outlines ways in which family physicians can raise their own awareness and pay more attention to cultural safety. A link to the document is provided below. We need to remind ourselves that any initiative in Indigenous health and or education needs to involve Indigenous communities as co-creators and partners. We also need to remember that more than half of Indigenous Canadians live in communities outside of reserves, which means that all family physicians across Canada should be equipped with best practices around cultural safety. We are a culturally diverse country, so this will benefit not only Indigenous Canadians, but also our broader patient base. As these and other related initiatives continue to evolve, we will do our best to keep you informed of new developments and resources. Until the next time, take good care.